Hey gorgeous, it's been a while, but I wanted to hurry up and make a tutorial before Halloween hits so you guys will have some ideas. So this look today is Poison Ivy from Batman or E from Adam and Eve, either or same, you know, theme. So what you'll need is some glitter styrofoam paper. You can get that from Michaels, Beverly's, Joann's. I got this specific paper at Beverly's. It was about $2 a sheet. You only need one sheet. You need some double-sided scotch tape, removable, and scissors eyelash glue and some green lip liner green eyeshadow that's all you'll need yeah i feel really cute i feel like i should be going somewhere i feel like almost like a superhero let me just kind of do a close-up so you can see the detail see mm -hmm. sexy let me zoom out a little bit so you can see the full face so yeah that's it on my earrings to show and I would suggest for a costume unless you're going out and buying one that's already like Adam Eve or whatever I would say just get like um like a nude bodysuit like the gymnast wear some nude stockings preferably ones with some glitter in it and you can just put like some um some clear rhinestones, not clear rhinestones, but some crystals, the Swarovski crystals, and just like stick them on there and get like some plants from the dollar store, something like that, and just kind of stick it on there any type of way just to give you that wild, you know, look like you're from the jungle or you're from the garden, um, whatever. Um, yeah, you just, you can, this is a really cute, creative, easy costume. And you'll be guaranteed to be the belle of the ball. So, let's get started. <laughs> first things first, I'm going to start off with my primer for my eyeshadow. I'm using the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. So, as always, I'm just dabbing it on there. And I'm not putting it on nicely just to get it on. And this is going to help the eyeshadow adhere better so you can see the full pigment of the colors that I'm going to use. Now the eyes are going to be real simple. I'm going to start off with a really rich medium brown and this is from a Victoria Jackson palette. I'm going to be using the darkest brown there. So I'm going to use my eyeshadow brush. I feel like it's been forever since I've made a tutorial, even though really it's only been a couple of weeks. It just feels like forever. I don't like to leave you guys like that, but I've been kind of busy. I'm just going to fill up the entire lid. Do the same on the other side. I'm just going to blend the edges with my blending brush, my MAC 224 brush, just to soften those edges. And this is a really quick, I don't think this look will really take a long time. Now that that's on there and all blended out, I'm going to follow with Urban Decay Half Bake. And I'm pretty much going to fill up this whole area and I'm not going to bother to fill in my eyebrows because they're going to be covered anyway. Here I'm going to put a little bit more of the medium brown just to kind of cancel out that harsh um, line. And because I want to deepen that crease, I'm going to go back with um, a different darker brown. I'm going to use the I Dream of St. Kitts by NYX, this palette here. And I'm going to go with the darkest brown that you see, this one here. Using my pencil brush, I'm going to use that to go in my crease just to deepen that and give it some dimension. And that makes a world of a difference. It doesn't look so flat now. And do the same thing on the other side. I'm gonna blend that again with the blending brush, just to bring everything together. Now we're just going real quick in a back and forth sweeping motion. This is going to be really sexy and sparkly 
And it's just gonna be everything when I'm finished, lady. So you can be cute on Halloween. Now it's time to do the liner. And I want to use my pencil liner. Usually I would use a liquid liner, but I don't want that type of look today. So I'm going to go with the pencil. And because I want this to be more romantic and kind of sultry, I'm going to use my smudger and kind of smudge what I already have. No, I think that's pretty good. Let me just smudge it some more on the other side. Now I'm gonna line underneath my eyes with that same liner that I used on my top eyelids. So now I'm gonna do my contouring. I'm gonna use some bronzer too. I'm gonna start with my bronzer. And I'm using palette by e.l.f. This is what it looks like. You can find this at Target or go to the website. I'm going to use my blush brush and I'm just going to swirl it over all the colors and I'm going to put it where the light will naturally hit my face. And kind of extend it out to where I'm going to contour. Okay, you see it gives it a nice glow nice soft glow so I'm gonna go with my handy dandy mineral powder so I'm gonna line the lips with Emerald City by NYX and I want my lips I'm gonna do them green to go with the whole poison ivy you know thing I'm gonna line the lips with Emerald City by NYX now before I finish put in the last applications one. I feel like this is a little bit plain. So to take it more out of the everyday look, I'm gonna put a little bit of green where I contoured. I'm gonna use a matte green, just so that the, the reflection from like a metallic won't, you know, mess up the contouring. So I'm gonna put just a little bit right in the center of where I contoured. I'm gonna apply the lashes. And I know you see a little bit of white, but it's gonna dry clear. So give it about a minute or so. So while that's doing its thing, I'm gonna get my double sided tape so I can stick these eyebrows on. And I'm just using a removal double sided tape by Scotch Tape. That's what it looks like. Put it like that, if you can see. Right there and I'm gonna put a little bit toward the bottom I'm gonna have it sit about right here and just press it down you're still kind of not sticking right there so I'm gonna do two small pieces I'll put the other piece on and then I'll be back okay gorgeous that's the finished look um, I kind of adjusted the eye piece more at an angle and for the very tips of it, it was too narrow for me to put the tape. So I just put a little bit of dual adhesive um, eyelash glue. And I add a little bit of green right in there to kind of camouflage the eyebrow. And that's it. I have on my leaf earrings. I feel like it goes pretty well with the Poison Ivy um, Eve theme. So that's the finished look. And it was pretty simple and fairly quick. So that's it. Have a great Halloween. Bye.